Some of you may ask, where does this type of stuff come from? Like, where does a big giant boot come from? Oh my gosh, look at that tooth, guys. I found a giant tooth. Man, that's a good piece right there. That's some really good detail on that one. This one here is absolutely amazing. Check out the detail on this one. Hey, what's up everybody? The Diamond Miner. Hope you all are doing well today. I'm at Ammonite Creek. It's around oh, 100 degrees. And I'm continuing on from a live stream. Those of you that were in the live stream, I was dropping out, probably lagging real bad. And my phone finally overheated to where it just ended the live stream. I'm not quite ready to do a live stream. We found some amazing fossilized coral ammonites. Let's take a look at what we already found. Gonna need to get the wagon over there. Some huge pieces. So that's what I'm doing on this adventure. I'm going and gathering fossilized coral. We gotta look for snakes. I just noticed a snake in the water. A little grass snake. All right, here we are at the spot. So earlier today, during the live stream, some of you may recall all of this here, what we found so far. Really? Man, something about this hill. That's the same spot where I flipped my wagon over and then flipped it over immediately after I got it going again. But here's what I found so far. Some nice imprints, nice ammonite, and this fossilized coral. And check out this piece. That's humongous. Hey, here's something right here I missed. Look at that. That's what I'm doing in this video is going around collecting this, this type of stuff. Notice this one here earlier. I'm going to take this one home. Man, that's a good piece right there. That's some really good detail on that one. So during the live stream, I worked my way over to this direction and that's when I noticed the buffering or you know the lagging and reconnecting. I'm like, crap. The live stream is going to fail and it did my phone finally reached the highest temperature and it just shut off it, the phone got too hot we were checking out this huge ammonite right here and this coral got some type of something right there like a plant or a stem and a small ammonite right there no telling what else and i tried to pick this up and it's so heavy i can't even move it so that would be something to team up with. I might need some help. Have some of you come out here and help me get some of this bigger stuff out of here. Some museum pieces. Decent piece right there, but that's not quite what I'm looking for. Pretty flattened out. Nice imprint. Oh my gosh, looky here. Walked over it a hundred times. <laughs> what do we have right there? Make sure there's not a snake under this rock. Okay, no soon. We got ants. We have ants. We got an ammonite right here, maybe, possibly, hopefully. Yeah, we'll let the ants settle down and come back for that one. If I don't forget. Been known to do that. Forget stuff. Like here lately, I forgot my kayak was in the back of my truck, sticking up vertical past the cab. And of course I went under something and my kayak did not clear and crushed it in half, taking out a nearly a two foot chunk, completely broke it, like a big hole in it. So I'll have to save up for a new kayak because I need it for this. Once the water level goes up, I'm gonna go up creek, way up creek. We're gonna go further than ever before up there. Oh, what do we have here? 
Something right there, but yeah, maybe just not the best detail and some really hard mud. That's the stuff you don't want to work on. Spider. Oh wow, look at this big tooth. Oh my gosh, look at that tooth, guys. I found a giant tooth. And right beside the big giant tooth, what do we have? A nice detailed coral. Wow, look at that. It's got some good detail. Kind of weird looking bug. Oh, and it's nice and flat. That's the ones I'm looking for. Nice and flat and easy to carry out of here. I could even put that in a box and ship it out. Yep. All right. Exactly what I'm looking for. Nice detailed coral. I always come over here because this is where I got my biggest ammonite. I think it was humongous. Oh, here's some more. Huge chunk. Pretty flat. Oh, yeah. Real flat. Nice and flat. That thing's massive. This is awesome. I'd love to have this right here. I cook some bacon and eggs on that. And pancakes. Holy cow. I could have pancakes. Oh, and it's nice and flat, too. It's a huge flat rock. Perfect for my grill. Oh, looks like it's uh, got some fossils on the other side. A little bit of fossils on the other side. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Cook my dinner on. Man, make an awesome dinner grill for. Oh, oh God. And I almost did a face plant. Oh, that's heavy. Threw me around like a rag doll. Oh wow, it's just like a giant Native American artifact. Man, did I find a giant scraper? You see right there where they've worked it down. You know, giants once lived here in this area. I'm over here in the shade cooling off taking safety meeting number eight and I noticed right here we have an ammonite <laughs> not the best looking one found a few more things over here like this uh, super heavy oh my gosh that right there just that is like 45 50 pounds you know maybe 45 pounds 40 it's heavy that could be more like a bone it's so heavy <laughs> and then over here i noticed this that's real lightweight of course it's thinner but it's just it's bigger and everything but it's just half the weight of that other one very cool piece i'm gonna save that one Probably a piece of the stem. Oh, what do we have here? Oh my god, a huge ammonite. Oh my gosh. Look at that. I've walked over this thing I don't know how many times. Not the best detail, but you can see that it's clearly a ammonite. Here's where it starts. That's the very start of it. Wow. That is so cool. It looks like it has one of those coral stuck to it or something awesome piece wow <laughs> man what a day so much fun out here you never know when that ammonite is gonna pop up and we just got one Woohoo! get this bad boy in the wagon clean this up it might show the detail a little better on it here's some pieces that i found earlier walking around real nice halves man that thing is huge what a fun day. All right, ended up with quite a few goodies from over here. Nice coral, a huge bone or something, some type of other plant, a huge ammonite, a giant tooth, 
and some bananas. Whoa, about passed one up. That one covered in ants. Went ahead and pulled it out. A little rough on that side. That side's got a little detail. It's just, man, it's just so much mud. It's the type of mud that almost like really hard to get off. This is all limestone. Even these ammonites are now fully limestone. Some of you may ask, where does this type of stuff come from? Like this big boot, you know, like where, where does a big giant boot come from? Well, I'll show you. It comes out of this layer right here. All this stuff that's underneath all of this mud. And as we walk down, you'll start to really see it. Like here's a nice piece sticking out. You know, it's kind of like a rounded, weird looking thing. But this is really lightweight. It's not, it's not heavy, like that big round one I found. Here's a piece sticking out, you know. And it'd be fun to come out here and lift this stuff up and see what's underneath it. See, it comes up pretty easy. That's a good chance of breaking the ammonites, breaking the fossils. Yeah, that's just not a really, I don't like to do it like that. Good way to damage the fossil. Out here, I let mother take its course. Good hard floods, washes all this up, breaks it loose, and whatever we get, we get. So it'd be nice to see the water levels back up to here. That's why all this is sticking out because the water normally is constantly running right here. And it's been a long time, almost a year since that has happened. Now well, getting closer to the truck, I gotta go unload, come back and get the rest of this. Over here by this piece of an ammonite with the minerals growing on it i've noticed two corals right here this one's not in very good shape but it's still pretty neat you know look at that this one here is absolutely amazing check out the detail on this one All cracked right there but look at these cavities <clears throat> wow look at this one guys Amazing detail. We've got to get this one out of here. That rock is just wedged in there. What we'll the chisel that thing out, drill it out, or something. This is awesome. We're going to get this one here. I carried it to this spot. And we're going to call it a day close to 12 o'clock it's time to get out of here it's starting to heat up and I'm hungry we're gonna take this one the ammonite with mineralization growing on it oh yeah can't pass that up get my saw cut that sucker Here's a nice piece. Check this one out. That one may even have a hole that will go through there. Man, clean this up. Be surprised. All right, if we can get this video up to 1,000 likes within one week of being uploaded, one of you will win this. All you have to do is leave a comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the like button. Let's take a quick look at everything that I saved. Even got a complete ammonite. Wasn't expecting that. I've been walking over this place now for weeks. Turned out to be a really good day. Let's get a better look at these minerals growing on that ammonite. 
almost looks like a calcite. Very cool. Hope you all enjoy this adventure. We found some amazing fossilized coral, all types of other plant life that's fossilized, and ammonite that has minerals. It looks like some type of crystals maybe growing on it. Could be a quartz crystal, but then almost has that look of like a calcite. Once the channel reaches 40,000 subscribers and it's not far off, we will have a special giveaway and you'll want to go to my Facebook page to see who wins that giveaway. It's going to contain unsearched diamond ore from the crater of Diamond State Park, a complete ammonite, a beautiful quartz crystal from Arkansas. Once we reach 50,000 subscribers, I'll be giving away a beautiful Arkansas diamond that's brown. It's almost like a chocolate color. And here pretty soon, I should have new merchandise coming out. T-shirt, a hat, coffee mug, but for now that's probably going to be about it. So if you'd like to get a t-shirt, be looking out for those. I'll be posting links in the uh, description of my videos. There'll be links on my community tab, Facebook, and when my merchandise sells, that'll really allow me to make more adventures and it'll definitely help add to the traveling more often and getting videos made. That's going to do it here at Ammonite Creek. I hope you all enjoy this adventure. We found some amazing fossilized coral. Once again, thank you all so much for watching. Until next time, take care, everybody. All right, time to get this wagon up to the truck. Fully loaded down. That's, man, that's some weight. This piece here, I would say it was about... 70 80 pounds that one's about 50 